Për sëri në banesën e snajperisit të famshëm, Mike Speth. Tani jo për koshorën e lavdishme, por për një luft tjetër që përbollet aj e cindra veteran të ushtris shlirimtarët e Kosovës, atë të mbjetesis. Well, after the war, of course, I had to leave Kosovo, because I was officially registered here as external advisor, more or less. We done our thing in Germany. I worked normally, you know, in a gun store in Berlin. Somewhere along the line, things got worse because of the job, because the background slowly came out that I was here. I moved from place to place. And uh, 2019, I moved permanently. Okay. <laughs> From the hotel to this apartment because there wasn't an apartment. You know, a lot of promises with everything that didn't happen. Po po po, yo yo yo. You know, but it's not everybody's fault. I'm telling you right now that the political ball game in the ministries is not supporting uh, the veterans the way they should. You know the deal. 170 euros for a normal veteran. How the hell is he going to live without an apartment? I got lucky I got shot. I, got, I, can, I actually got to say I got lucky I got blown up, shot, and everything else. So I can pay for the apartment. And that's 220 euros a month. So you got electricity coming to it in the wintertime. That's 60 euros, 70 euros. Now they're talking about making 40% even more expensive. Then it'd be 100 euros. Uh, what the heck is left out of 392 euros? Nothing. You know? And uh, you've got to do something in order to survive. Për mes shkrimeve e analizave që i plason në rjetës sociale, a ja rinë të siguroj në bjetesën, por tentimi për të siguruar voluntarisht vaksinën anti-Covid i ka siel të lashe. Well, I'll be honest with you, okay? After the last five days, so many people on Facebook, there was such a shit going on, in good English, you know, disrespectful, disrespectful, Fake news uh, about me uh, is not normal anymore. And somewhere along the line, after working so hard, almost a quarter century now for Kosovo, doing the right thing, you just get after five days, uh, because they work on COVID or some assessments, you get such a hatred. If you don't like court, you, they're going to hit you? Well, what kind of attitude is that? You know? That's not right. And the hate po uh, mails I get in Facebook, it's not right either, you know, or threats and everything else. I mean, from the Serbs, I'm used to it. Yeah. But for my own people, and the shame is, they're not even in Kosovo, most of them. They're somewhere in Germany, Switzerland, uh, Oslo, Norway, or whatever. Kushtet jo adekuate për tjetuar. Ofendimet e ditve të fundit e quan frankon në një vendim jot leht, që të lëviz drejt durësit. Hatri ka mbetur edhe të këqeveria e re, që pavarësisht kualifikimeve të ti ushtarake nuk merë asë njerë përgjigje. I don't know, the attitude has to change, okay, especially with the new government. I mean, my emails might not be perfect, okay? I'm not an English literature teacher or professor. The bad thing is, when they don't answer, you know, they just say, we don't have any interest, or thank you for your offer, we try, you know? But nothing? So what's, what's, what's going to make me stay here? Accept my expertise? Take my advice? Answer me. If I'm not right for the job, then tell me. Mike Speth, shërbeo si snajperist i ushtris shlirimtare të Kosovës, në beteje në Kosharës që zgjati nga 9 prilli, dhere më dhjetë qërshor të vitit 1999.